take a rear spar and just test fit that in position so you've got a good feel of how that's going to go and then get your glue ready and then place your glue on the ends of your reinforcement ribs and then place your rear spar into position. And as you can see here we've placed some clamps on the ends of the ribs okay so basically just allow that to dry making sure that everything is nice and neatly into position. Once that's completely dried take another 4x4 four four strip and place that on the edge like so and then just mark it off at the end of the spar and cut this piece off once we've cut that off we're then going to be placing that section there now once you've done that turn your wing over and take another 4 by 4 millimeter strip and just place that in the grooves and button up to the last one. Take a pencil, just mark off once again at the end of the rib there, and then cut that off. And then just test fit and get ready to glue that into that position and then allow that to dry. Take the upper wing tip rib sheet that came with this stage and identify the parts and then mark them off with a pencil so that you've got D, C, B, A and then notice that we're going to be putting them in here D, C, B and A. So get your glue ready and um, you can test fit them if you want but get your glue ready and we're going to be then putting the four wing tip ribs in that position. Once you've done that, take ribs E and F and just test fit those in position like so and then get your glue ready and we're going to be gluing them in that position like so. Final part of the stage, I'm going to take the rib G and we're going to be placing that over the top like so. So once again get your glue ready and glue that into position.